Welcome to Car Garbage Garage. Today we're gonna try to wire this uh, Chinese rear view m m camera and some, you know, sensors here. So, the parking system. It's gonna be a quick one, just how to wire this. Uh, we're gonna install it in this Daihatsu material here, but I don't know. I'm not gonna go to these to the details of the car because I just wanted to show you how to wire this. So we have like a license plate frame here with the parking sensors and rear view camera, uh, wires for sensors, wires from for camera. Uh, this like a monitor for rear view sensors. Uh, this is a unit for for uh, for the parking sensors and here's the uh, power plug for rear view camera and this is the video connection for the camera to the head unit so these parts were all included in this set so I'm just gonna need additional additional uh, plug with these uh, video in uh, plugs to my head unit that was also included with the head unit uh, the head unit is uh, like Android cheap uh, universal multimedia unit so this is all cheap in China so without further ado let's start this job so first things first, uh, roughly stuff all your wires uh, through the holes where you need them to go. Um, in my case I put the upcoming wires to the front uh, from the light sense plate, uh, you know, frame here through this hole, you know, like between the bumper and the body. And the second thing is to find the uh, reversing bulb, uh, like where your reversing light is, and uh, find the positive and the negative of it. If you have just positive, uh, then negative would be like any hole here or whatever, like uh, you can uh, use your body like as a negative, this one is where the red plug was it was it is it's a uh, power for your rear view camera this green one is uh, is the one that i extended so this one is the other side of this cable so it's exactly the same on that side uh you just need to connect this one the positive of your uh, reversing light so yeah uh, this is going to that uh, and the other part that I have here is already stuffed through this through this rubber rubber sealant sealing sealant here that seals the uh, let's say entering point to your uh, interior here the other wires that you need to connect to the power is your um, power supply for your parking sensors here so mm, you have like this uh, let's say brains of your parking sensor so uh, this power goes to this socket here like it says power here so yeah I have done all the power that I needed now I can you know seal everything up, uh, tidy up and move on. So order here and now here's for the parking sensor, sensor part is uh, I plugged up the power, uh, the monitor will go towards the front of the car uh, the same as this, this uh, uh, video uh, output wire. I already started to run it uh, towards the front also, also and uh, of course it's a good way to uh, check to mark your you know sensors wi sensor wires before uh, uh, 
before this uh, stuffing through the holes process because after that you need to plug them into the correct uh, port here so uh, I did that my I have just two so uh, the uh, the left one is unmarked and the right one is marked so uh, these are the middle ones this is the same as that's you can imagine this as a, a rare bumper here so like uh, the uh, left side of the car, the right side of the car. Th these are the middle ones and these are the outside. I'm gonna stick this uh, uh, sensor brain box with this provided double-sided tape in in that hole there. And I'm gonna leave that. It got dark but I hope you can see what I'm doing. So, okay, I have my head unit here. Um, so, first thing uh, video in so we need to plug this plug this into this socket here uh, maybe like that oh yeah okay so we have like a, all our auxiliary connections here and in this in this socket if we look to this diagram here we have like ground, a like power here, like first, first, third, and fifth is our parking sensor here. So I found this like here, uh, like ground positive as red, and this pink one is named here by the label label back so yeah this one is for the backup so this should be connected with with this red one here and this one we're gonna find like video in yeah video in first so these two also need to be connected and that's it uh, you can put this part here anywhere you want but I'm gonna you know hide it somewhere behind the glove box or whatever it still makes eeping sounds uh, when you back up so sound feedback is enough for us and I was freaking wrong uh, on the video input you should use this smaller uh, plug here it was shown in the in the picture here so my mistake so as I thought everything works fine we put into reverse we hear a beep uh, and we have the video input from our new camera yep that's it the worst part is always the thing that you need to put the wire behind behind the panel and it's also every time different for every Car, so I'm not getting into this I just wanted to show you where to put some wires and that's it so thank you for watching and bye